To find the percent composition by mass for each element here in CaNO32, this is calcium nitrate, we'll use this equation here. So the first thing we need to figure out in our equation is the molar mass of the compound. So this whole compound here, we want to know the molar mass. When we do that, we find we have a molar mass of 164.10 grams per mole. So now we can do it for each element. We'll take the molar mass for each element and then multiply it by the number of that element. Then we divide by the molar mass for the compound. So let's do that for calcium. For calcium on the periodic table, calcium is 40.08 grams per mole. We only have one calcium atom, so the number of atoms is one. So we leave it like that, divide it by the molar mass of the compound, then we multiply by 100 to get a percent, and we end up with calcium being 24.4 percent. So if we had a mass of this compound here, 24.42 percent of that by mass would be calcium. Let's figure out the nitrogen. For the nitrogen, on the periodic table, the molar mass for nitrogen, 14.01. And note that up here, the grams per mole, they're on top and bottom, they're going to cancel out. So I'm not going to write them here. And then nitrogens, I have two times the one here. So I have two nitrogen atoms. So the number of the element here that's 2, and then I divide that by the molar mass for the compound. Multiply by 100, and we get 17.07%. Next, we'll finish up with the oxygen. So for the oxygen, oxygen on the periodic table, 16.00 grams per mole, and we have 2 times 3, so we have 6 oxygen atoms. We divide by the molar mass for the compound again, multiply by 100, we end up with 58.50, and that's percent. So if you add all of these numbers up, they should be very close to 100. In this case, because I'm rounding to two decimal places, my periodic table goes out to two decimal places, I'm a little bit off, I think 0.01%. So it should be very close, though. This is Dr. B with the percent composition by mass for each element in CaNO3-2, calcium nitrate. Thanks for watching.